All right. This is my rant because I'm like getting really fed up with listening to all this crap on the freaking internet. You got, it doesn't matter what color you are. If you're going to go out and live a gangster life, plan on getting shot and killed. You got to take responsibility for your actions, period. It doesn't matter whether you're white, whether you're black, blue, green, it does not matter. These people going out and rioting because of these young boy, these young black men getting killed. God forbid anybody get killed. Granted, all right. That's that's bad. I have. That's bad. But if you don't resist arrest, if you comply with the officers, if you're not out doing stupid shit to begin with. You're not going to get shot nine times out of ten. And then you got the Democrats and all these media places, uh, the TV stations out there just agging it on, race baiting. They want us against each other. Do y'all not see that shit? This irritates me. I don't understand how the... This country has gotten to where it is. It wasn't anything like this when I was young. I'll be 52 in May. I don't get it. I just don't get it. We, we could walk from my house to the store, which was maybe a half a mile, a little over a mile, a little under a mile, when we was kids by ourselves. No issues. But everybody's gone freaking crazy. We've taken God out of everything. We've taken him out of the schools. We've taken God out of our government. Now we want to bring in this socialist bull crap. But you take God out of everything and this is what happens. When you don't discipline your children, this is what happens. You're going to have kids that are very disrespectful. Put the Ten Commandments back in play. Honor thy mother and father. Hello? You're supposed to respect people. Not be little thugs. White kids trying to be black kids. It, it's, it's stupid. Y'all have... This is for the black people, all right? No, I'm not racist. You can call me a bigot. You can call me whatever you want to call me. I don't really give a crap at the moment because I'm pissed. I'm mad. I've been watching these videos on this uh, right shooting. And the kids got video up, videos up smoking a freaking joint and holding a gun and trying to be a gangster. But yet, TV and everybody else is trying to paint him as an angel. Hello? The only thing that I'm saying is, is my kids. I had one. I've got four boys. And I had one that used to try to be a gangster. Yes, he's a little white boy. But race shouldn't matter. But he's grown out of that. He's now married. He has kids. He has responsibilities. It's all in how you raise your kids. You got to be there for your kids. You can't just let the government raise your kids. People need to get off their asses, get jobs, teach their kids how to be an adult. I don't care what color you are. Why has everything got to be race? Oh, it's about race. Oh, my God. Christina's saying this, so she must be a bigot. No, I'm not a bigot. I'm just, I'm of an American citizen. And I'm so tired of all of this crap. And we sit back and we do nothing. The Democrats are going to, Democrats, 
and the Republican, just to be clear. They're playing us like fools. Ain't It's like a big movie screen. They're going to pretend to be pissed off at the Democrats. The Democrats are going to be pissed off at the Republicans. It's all a game. It's all a show. Just to keep us separated and apart. It is not in our nature to be this hateful to each other. God didn't make us this way. He made us to love one another and to help one another, regardless of our skin color. And it's not all about race. Ugh, people just aggravate me. Because we're being played. And nobody seems to get it. We need to get people off of welfare, get people working, get Russia, China, Iran, Islam, all these different countries, get them out of the picture. We need to start making things here in America. Made in the USA. Where's the pride in made in the USA now? Everything in the USA gets sent overseas gets redid or revamped and then gets sent back and we pay and why we can support ourselves but we the people have to stand up and 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 make it happen these government bureaucrats in Washington these career politicians they're not in it for us. Regardless of what they tell us, they're not in it for us. They're in it for themselves and to line their own damn pockets. Period. I don't get it. I, just, I, I don't get it. Pull out your Bibles and read Daniel and read Revelation. And read the different books in the New Testament. And it tells you exactly what's happening and what's going to happen. And we're just sitting back and letting it happen. Doing nothing. I, I don't know. Where are we going to wake up, people? Because this is bull, bull.